Hey guys, Andrew B. 1998 back with you once again. Time for part 18 of my clamshell VHS collection. Last left off with, with Balto. We're going to move on from there. And I have two copies of Barney's Great Adventure, the movies. I know some of you may some of you may not like Barney. I do respect your opinion on Barney. So this is the first copy. This is my childhood copy. It's Barney's first movie ever. It's front, side, profile Barney. Back, scenes, bigger, bolder, and better. It's everyone's favorite dinosaur. It's his very f first movie ever. Dynamite, the best family movie for young kids. This is New York Post. A terrific family film. Says Time Out, New York. And my mommy loved it too. This is Justine of age three. This is the actual tape itself. The ink label. It's a print. There's some printing in invisible ink. I can't see it. It's hard to see it. This is the second copy which I got at a used book superstore in Arkansas. Uh, and this one's also got a printed invisible ink. Next is... Beethoven's fourth. It's front, side, character profile, Beethoven. The back says, It's double trouble as America. As most of all, the dog, Beethoven is back in an all new hilarious adventure. Mm, so, 2001 VH. The sticker label. It's printed on the 50th week of 2004. Even, so, this is a reprint. This is actually a 2001 VHS. Next is Beethoven's fifth, I think it's 2002 VHS. Front, sank from well, Beethoven. Back, the scenes, America's favorite St. Bernard is back. I don't have Beethoven's third. I think I might have, I do have Beethoven's first. I don't think I have Beethoven's second either. The actual tape itself, the sticker label, this one was printed on the fifth week of 2004, so this is a this is act reprint, but this is actually a 2003 VHS. Not a 2002 VHS. I lied when I said it was a 2002 VHS. Next is Big Fat Liar. It's a fast-paced, funny comedy. This is Jeffrey Lyons of WNBC TV. Front, side, back, the scenes. Utterly charming and hilarious as Richard Roper of Ebert and Roper. Two thumbs up says, says Ebert and Roper. I, yeah, this is 2002 VHS. <clears throat> the actual tape itself, the sticker label. Weekend Year Co-op here is the 34th week of 2002. Yep. Uh, uh. And the next tape I'm going to show you, I have two copies of Casper, 1996 VHS. The first copy which I got in 2012 for Christmas, Seeing is Believing. It's the front, it's the side, back, scenes. A family fantasy comedy of astonishing technical achievements is Michael Wilmington of Chicago Tribune. And here's the actual tape itself with the sticker label. We can your code up here is the 33rd week of 1995. So this this is really a 1995 VHS, not a 1996 VHS. Here's the second copy which I got factory sealed. <laughs> the actual tape itself with the sticker label. We can your code up here is 34th week of 1995. So these two were both printed. Print a week and year, a week, a week apart, and yeah. Next tape I'm going to show you this. Let's okay. We get these two Casper tapes back in first. Okay, here's Cat in the Hats. I think it's 2004 VHS. It's 
enormously funny. This is Jeffrey Lines of NBC TV. Front, side, front, cat in the hat, back, scenes, the book, classic book comes to life. Yeah, yeah, this is really 2004 VHS. Actual tape itself with a sticker label. It's got blue lid and black reels. Print dates, February 13th, 2006. This is obviously a reprint. It's printed the day before Valentine's Day that year. That's why this tape is so rare. Because of the print date. Next is the 1996 VHS of E.T., which I got in 2015 on December. That's May 18th, 2000. May 17, 2015. The story, story that touched the world. Front, the side, back, the scenes. No critic review. It's the actual tape itself with the ink label. Print dates. This, the, the week and year codes 29th week of 1996. This is. Yes, yeah, so I was right about this being a 1996 VHS. And we're not done with that yet because I have. The, the 2002 special edition VHS, it's the limited edition VHS. Remember I had a copy of this tape when I was little, but it broke. It's front, it's side, back, scenes. E.T. is a masterpiece. It's Luminic of New York Post 2002 and Extraordinary. It says A.O. Scott, New York Times 2002. This limited edition release includes 20 minutes of behind the scenes footage plus a new introduced production to the film by Steven Spielberg. <coughs> and here's the actual tape itself, the ink lab sticker label. Print date, week in your code, 39th week of 2002. I think the week in your code on my old copy that I had when I was a kid was the 40th week of 2002. <coughs> Yep, it didn't have the savings book in it. But I, I know my copy I had when I was a kid had had just plain white reels. <clears throat> the next tape is the it's a demo VHS of Hercules and Xena, the battle for Mount Olympus, not for sale or rental. This is actually a demo tape. It's the front, side, the back. Scenes, no correct review. It's the actual tape itself, the sticker label, it's got a universe, MCA Universal Video End Label. It's printed on the week in your code. The, the 44th week of 1997. Yep. The next. I have three Grinch. How oh, the Grinch stole Christmas. 2001 VHS. This is the first first green clamshell copy, which I got in 2014 at the Samaritan Shop in Springdale, Arkansas. It's front side for all the Grinch. Back scenes an instant classic because Jay Carr of the Boston Globe. Ugh. Sorry, I just got a frog in my throat. It's the actual tape itself with a sticker label and the week in your codes, 32nd week, 2001. Mm -hmm. Here's the <clears throat> second clamshell copy, which my aunt gave this tape to me for Christmas <clears throat> in 2014. The week in here goes the 41st week of 2001. Okay. Here's the white clamshell copy. This is my only white clamshell copy that I have in my collection. This one was printed the 43rd week of sales one, so these two were printed two weeks apart. Why is there a frog in my throat? I got it. Next tape I'm going to show is the clamshell VHS of Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat. It's one of the cheap clamshells. Front. Side, back, scenes, no critic review. Here's the actual tape itself. The sticker label, it's a 2000 VHS. Printed, it was printed the 41st week of 2000. Okay. Next, 
what I'm going to show you in this video. This is the 1990 something VHS of Land Before Time. A New Adventure is Born. The front, the side, back, scenes, no critic review. 1996 it says. It's the actual tape itself, the sticker label. It's got the MC Universal Home Video and label. Week in your codes, the 47th week in 1997. Even though this is the 1996 VHS, this is a reprint. <laughs> Next we have these two. These are both 2001 VHSs. It's got the same label as the 1996 VHS. This one printed on the 46th week of 2002, so this is a reprint. It's got black reels. And... Now here's the 2001 Canadian VHS of Land Before Time. It's all because of the Canadian home video rating. Right there. This is the actual tape itself. The stick label. There's no print date on here. But there is some... Mm, some printing information, though. But, no print date on this tape. Because Canadian tapes do not have print dates. Zachary Dackman, if you're watching this, Kids Motion VeggieTales tapes do not have print dates either. Next, I have two copies of Land Before Time 2, 1994 VHSs. This is the first copy which I got in 2014, back in January. It's the front, sank, Carefell of the Dinosaur. Back, scenes, no critic review. The actual tape itself with the sticker label. Print the week in year codes, the 12th week in 1995, so this is a later copy. Here's the second copy, which I got for backup. Week in year codes, 45th week in 1994. And... Here's the Land Before Time 3, the time of the great giving. I think it's 90, this is 1995 VHS. The front, the side, the back, scenes, no critic review. Special bonus, the video cassette contains a music video preview for Littlefoot's next exciting adventure, the Land Before Time 4, Journey Through the Mists, which is what I'm going to show after the next copy of Land Before Time, in time of great giving. Actually, tape itself with the sticker label on the Week in year codes, the 46th week in 1995. And I think I have time for one more in this video. This is the 1990, I think it's 2001 VHS, the time of great giving. Front, side, back, scenes, no critic review. Tape, sticker label, it's got black reels. Print dates, the 12th week of 2003. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this part, and I will see you in part 19. So, peace out.